Hi vlog, I don't know if you can tell from the way that I'm dressed, but I'm back. I'm back on Oahu and I'm so, so happy. I'm visiting for two weeks and I was kind of hesitant at first to vlog just because of my skin, but I figure it's whatever. This is what I look like. I'm obviously gonna wanna remember this trip, so I might as well start vlogging. So you haven't missed much. Actually, that's a lie. Um, it was Kamalu's birthday and Nick's birthday on the 4th and the 6th. So we had quite, quite a bit of, what, what is the word? Quite the festivities. We, we celebrated. So I will put in some clips or maybe photos of the festivities here. Let me catch you up, I guess. Basically, I booked this trip kind of last minute because I have been struggling a little bit out in New York and the ticket, so I booked it. And then it was really good motivation knowing that I was coming here. So I worked probably twice as much as normal just to kind of compensate for the fact that I'm here now for two weeks. It's crazy, I've just been catching up with everyone and it's really, really surreal because it feels like I'm home. Where is Ellen? Hello? Oh gosh. While I've been in New York, I have been craving this one specific wrap from this one specific place on island. And I've even had a dream about it. And I'm so excited. <laughs> Is he snapshot his back in Hawaii? Did you want to say anything about the sunset? Okay. Important zoom surf Publix. We should surf Publix because it's flat. I can. We're at Waikiki. Like and subscribe. We're at the zoo, that's where we are. They're gonna surf, they're, they're gonna surf for the first time. It's gonna be bad, I think. It's gonna be fire. It's gonna be flat. Hello vlog, I'm currently walking over to pick up some sushi and then we're going over to my friend's house. The thing is we were all supposed to go on a booze cruise and we found out an hour before we were supposed to be there that it's rescheduled. Somehow the captain isn't showing up. So we're bringing the booze cruise to Maddie's house. But first I need sushi. I don't want to sound like a broken record but I don't want to leave Hawaii. If anyone knows of a way that I could keep living here, please comment it down below because I really, really don't want to leave. This place has natto and that's how you know it's legitimate. Y'all, what a steal. I just got three rolls for $7. I think she gave me a discount because I spoke to her in Japanese, so it's kind of sick. The pizza store? I don't know, I'm sorry. The luck. Oh, it's right there. That's funny. Um, anyways, the boys are getting McDonald's and White Claws. Look how pretty it is. I love Hawaii. <laughs> There's these dogs from the neighbors that always just show up. And another one came in. This one's cute. Oh, yeah, yeah, you had this one pull up with you, right? Yeah. <laughs> Matthew wanted to keep this one, but not the other one. Not the other guy? Sit. Roll over. <laughs>
looks like a subway oh, sign or something. I feel like we just go this way. Bringing all of this sauce to one side, so I have to go like that. She's a little messy, but she looks good. What? The brownies. Oh, the brownies. Mm -hmm. Hi guys, I'm feeling nostalgic because I am back at the coffee shop where I did most of my remote schoolwork the past two semesters. And I'm just doing, I'm working on a literature review. I just finished my remote work for the day and now Ellen is going to pick me up so we can surf. It's a good longboarding day, I think. We just finished surfing Koalos. Is it K-Wallos or Koalos? K-Wallos. K-Wallos. And it was perfect. It the was waves, so good. they were small but consistent. One of the longest rides I've ever had. Oh, yeah, I saw them. We just got our favorite things ever smoothie. <laughs> Apparently, carrot juice is very in, green juice is out. Let it be known. Orange is the new green. green. <laughs> They moved the chocolate since the last time I was here. Pears are on sale, so I'm getting some. <laughs> what is this? All these, all they found all these Russian TikTok sounds. How do you find the most hectic audios? We are at a tide pool. Oh, zoom in on Colin's Hey guys, there's your favorite YouTuber right there. Look at that f***ing bog. This water's insanely clear. So, he got swept by the current. No, I did not. <laughs> Wait, that's what happened? What happened? No, I tried to go through a tunnel, and then the current sucked me back through the tunnel, and I seen better days but it's okay I'm going to do some remote work it's 8 30 a.m. and I have a meeting at 11 so that's like a good window of time and then after that I think I'm gonna go surfing with my friend and then tonight we're all going camping and I'm excited and I have no idea how that's gonna work because there's like 14 of us I feel like this trip was very necessary for me because the past two months in New York I've just been struggling because I missed it so much here and 
feel like this was a good get, like getting it out of my system maybe. I'm not sure, um, but I leave Hawaii in a couple of days and then back to reality. Not that this isn't reality, but back to my reality where, you know, my apartment is and everything is and school and work. And I am excited to just, I think, spend more time with myself this summer and also prioritize myself and really focus on work and just making the most of this year that I have in New York because New York City is a really cool place and I am really lucky to get to live there and it's definitely a really cool place to spend your early 20s in so i am ready to embrace it and to fully be there because past two months i've definitely spent it kind of pouting wishing i was here in hawaii but i feel like i'm ready to go back and be there so yeah the boys are currently at costco they're getting grilling stuff because we're going camping tonight which is exciting and I'm excited to stargaze. Also, I have brownies in the oven because I stress baked because I was having a bit of a crisis um, about leaving, but I really do think I'm ready. Also, my skin, that's okay. I think I'm gonna give myself like a year. I feel like in a year, hopefully my skin will be clear. But in the meantime, I'm just going to accept the fact that this is what I look like. It's okay to be sad and it's good to just let yourself kind of feel what you're feeling and be vulnerable and accept it and then that way you can move on instead of just pretending like you're not sad because that is not going to help you get over whatever you're sad about. And make some brownies if you're sad. I don't know if they're done though. Oh, they're not done. Though. the prettiest sunset. Look at it. It's kind of going away now, but, but enjoy. Twice. We're grilling and going. We're grilling and going. We don't want to get mobbed. <laughs> oh, there be light. Oh, I'm zooming in on Cody's eyes. It's nice. <laughs> going however it's a little weird because I never grilled in pitch black so maybe you'll get one raw maybe you'll get one well cooked you never know have you ever grilled with that view though I'm loading the car to go surf, and I'm excited because normally we surf rock piles, which is always very shallow, and there's sea urchins everywhere. And instead, we're going to my preferred break, which is Kaiser's. so crazy all the tourists are back when i got here this was the first beach i went to and there wasn't a single soul hi it's Alyssa. and we're at two espresso before we go get our nails done see spicy evening look at our nail oh wait <laughs> my kid oh. oh no nails <laughs> <laughs> nick made me dinner yum what's in it 
So there's a local mocha. Pretty much it's rice, beef patty, egg, and then gravy, but bacon and Portuguese sausage, fried rice. And that's the only thing I did different. Got a little garnish on top too. Yum. It is my last full day here. My flight is at 11.30 p.m. tonight. I'm so sad, but today I just want to see all my friends and surf one last time. Also clean a little bit. I came back because I really missed it, but now part of me is like, maybe I shouldn't have come back because it makes leaving harder and it makes being in New York harder. Leaving was hard, and now I'm gonna have to leave again and then go through the whole process of reacclimating to New York again. This background kind of looks like a, a Vogue Beauty Secrets background. Walking to my gate now. I lost my AirPods. And I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you for watching. It was a beautiful trip. I'll see you in New York.